What's up everybody? Bonnie here. Welcome back to another video. We're back. We're back at uh, getting some mangrove crabs. Man, they are everywhere today. They're all over the boardwalk. Look at this. Yeah, here's one, here's one, here's one. Oh no, they're gone. This guy's stuck. Got him. <laughs> yes. That's what we're looking for right there. I see one right here, guys. Let's see if I can't reach him. He's right here. I got him. Oh yeah, that right there is what we're looking for. Here's another one right behind this branch. Oh, he ran down. I saw it. <laughs> they are fast. Here we go, guys. Here's another one. Right here. I got him. Oh. He's not too big, but that guy will do. Here's another one. This is too easy, guys. I think we got like a dozen already, but we're gonna get probably a dozen more and then um, we're gonna start fishing. Oh, that's a big one. That is a big one, guys. Look at that. Sheep's head bait. All right, boys, we got the goods. Look at all the crabs in there, man. That's plenty of bait for uh, sheep's head. Hopefully, hopefully we go through some sheep's head today. It's been a while since I've targeted sheep's head, but um, we got the right bait. We shouldn't have any problems getting uh, sheep's head today. Got one. First one of 2020. That's a good one there, man. Oh, I didn't think he'd be here, but he's here. That's probably a 12 incher, 12, 13 incher there. That owner hook, man, right on the corner of the mouth. That's that Gorilla Light size one. Look at that, baby. Sheep's head, Sammy. That's a good one, man. That's what's been biting my line, this little guy here. All right, we're gonna have to go somewhere else, man. The sheep's head are not thick out here. Yeah. That's a good snook bait right here. We just left our last spot, cause uh, I don't know what happened, the bite just stopped. I guess there was only like one or two over there. There weren't, there weren't that many over there, just caught that, just that one. Hopefully we get some more over here, man. We'll see what happens. Wow. So much grass but the water is just starting to come in so hopefully hopefully the water just pushes the grass out of the way but um all right we just got here let's give it a shot oh no way i think i'm eight guys i'm eight. Oh my goodness he broke that leader sliced from the barnacles if you guys are wondering those are the hooks i'm using for today it's an owner gorilla light size one and it's sharp, man. Let me tell you, these are some of the best hooks for uh, for sheep's head. Oh, there's 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 some sheep's head right there on that post. Here we go. Another one. He's a keeper. Look at that. No way. No way. This is the guy that broke me off earlier. Could you believe that, man? That's my Yozuri fluorocarbon leader, 20 pound. And my owner hook right here in his mouth. Two, he's got two owner hooks in his mouth. That's amazing. That's amazing. So that means if you lose a fish, guys, whoops. There's a chance that, um, that he'll still come back for the, uh, the bait. Not a bad one there. There's one hook. Here's my other hook. These guys are hungry. I'll keep that. There's that one, guys. He's probably 12 inches there. Not bad. All right. We just had to take a thumbnail picture really quick. All right, we're going to send this guy. Here we go. Ooh, that made a, made a little splash. Kind of spook him a little bit, but I'm pretty sure they'll come back around because that crab's pretty, uh, pretty juicy. 
There's another one. He's small. We are gonna have to let him go. Tiny. He's probably nine, ten inches. Not a keeper. They gotta be at least twelve inches. There it is. Ah, he's small. He is small, but he's fat. There it is. That's probably uh, 11 inches there. Not a keeper. All right, here's another one. Look at those crushers though, man. This is why they feed on barnacles, because they have crushers. Oh, he almost chomped down my, my thumb, but that's what they use to crush the barnacles and crustaceans, crabs. So they feed on. That is why they're tasty. See ya. I thought we were gonna go to a different spot. We actually did, but it didn't look good. The water is too high. But uh, we made our way back to this spot here, and I see a lot of sheep's head along these pillars here. Let's see if we can get one to bite. Yes, finally got him to bite. I downsized the leader to 20 pounds. And we got ourselves a sheep's head. So weird, man. I was using 25 pounds and these guys wouldn't touch it. I don't know what's going on, but... Got him on the 20 pound. He's a little small. He's, pro he's probably 11 inches. We're gonna have to let him go. Pretty cool. We we're just gonna call it, man. The bite just completely stopped. I think it's a little early for the big ones to start showing up, like the 14, 15 inches. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys haven't already, please hit that like button, hit that bell notification, smash that subscribe button if you haven't already, and I will see you guys in the next one.